praise the lord hallelujah what a wonderful god we serve he is the same yesterday he is the same today he is the same forever when god says yes no man can say no when god opens a door no man can close it when god raise you up no man can bring you down there is power in the word of god i come your way again my name is apostle robert Jani to speak to you for some few moments concerning the power in the word of god the power in the word of god the word of god carries potential power to change our life the bible said in the beginning was the word and the word was with god and the word was god that is the potential and the power of the word of god the word was with god and the word was god so wherever the word of god goes god goes wherever the power of god goes the word of god goes it means god and his word cannot be separated the same effect that the word will deliver is the same effect that god delivers so god and his word are one the word of god and god himself there is no difference his word is himself the power that god carries is the same power that the word of god carries there is no difference anybody looking for god should look for the word of god if you are looking for god you want to see god's power you want to see his saving power you want to see who God is, please go for the word. Praise God. Go for the word. For the word carries same potential, same power, same efficacy, same strength. In fact, the Bible says in the book of Psalm 107, verse 19 and 20, psalm 107 verse 19 and 20. the account of the bible says that, that some people that were going through some kind of frustration and they were looking for god and they needed god desperately to save them from their destruction and the bible says that they cried unto god they were looking for god to save them from their destruction and in that situation they cried unto god and the bible says that god didn't go by himself <laughs> he sent his word praise god when they were looking forward to have seen god calm down to declare i am the, i'm god i am the lord they did not see anything like that all they saw was that god sent forth his word hallelujah god did what he sent forth his word and the bible said when the word got to them the same thing they were expecting god to come and do for them that is what the word of god did for them many of us these days are looking for other things apart from the word of god and i want you to know that there is nothing as powerful as the word of god because the word is god himself I, in my previous teaching, I was speaking to my audience about getting hold of the word. 
that if you have nothing to hold on if your world is so empty there is nothing to hold on no job nothing no money no bank account no educational background no social status what you got to do is to look for the word of god when you get the word of god get hold of it if you can get hold of the word of god the bible says that that word will transform you that word will change you because anybody that get hold of the word of god has gotten hold of god himself and nobody gets hold of god and go back home the same there must be a testimony I challenge you to the truth today that don't look for anything nobody can help you in this world like God Almighty God nobody can feel the emptiness and the gap in your life like God get hold on the Word of God on every subject of your life on every area of your life just get hold of the word and you are gotten hold of God and the same miracles you would think when God have descended, He will do that same thing will happen to you when you hold the word, walk with the word, and you allow the word of God to transform you, to change you, your attitude, your behavior, your thoughts. You will see mighty, mind blowing miracles. I read for you now from Psalm 107, verse 19 and 20. The Bible said, Then they cried unto the Lord in their trouble and he severed them out of their distress he sent his word and healed them and delivered them from their destruction so they cried unto God to save them from their trouble and God didn't go but sent his word so any man that comes to you with the word of God has come to you with God himself Let's hold upon the word and we shall see manifestations. For God and his word are one. We all understand that Jesus Christ is embodiment of the word. He is the word. And Jesus said, I and my father are one. The word and God, they are the same. When you get hold of this word, you can change everything that is staring at you right now you can change your life you can change your situation be it financial material physical spiritual there is nothing that you can do with the word because the bible says in the beginning was the word the word was with god and the word was god and there was nothing that was made without the word praise god there was nothing that was made without the word so you can't you can't actually achieve anything without the power of the word. That is why the Apostle Paul said on the other day, he said, I am not ashamed of the word of God. I am not ashamed of the gospel, for it is the power of God unto salvation. It is the power of God. It can do anything for you. No matter what you are looking for today, get hold of the word. He sent forth his word, and his word healed them. So there is the power of healing in the word. Are you sick today? Go for the word. The Bible has several scriptures that talk about healing. If you get hold of that word, you will see your body transform. You will see every sickness getting out of your body. You will see your body being made whole. Because the word of God will enter into your life. In the book of Hebrews chapter 4 verse 12, the Bible says that the word of God is like, it's a two sharpened edge sword. A two sharpened edge sword. It penetrates. So the word will penetrate right even to your bone marrow. And that word will heal your body. And that word will make you whole. If financial situation that the word of god enter into those scriptures get hold of them use them let them change your attitude and your thoughts allow yourself to be used 
to, to, to come under the control of those words. And you will see the word of God delivering mighty miracles. I'm just here to tell you today that the, the word of God is God himself. And when you get hold of it, you have gotten hold of God. God bless you for watching this broadcast at this moment. There is power in the word of God. I'll come your way again another time. Bless you. And I pray for you. I stay safe and stay sound. In Jesus' name.